Yes, you're recording. Okay, go ahead and look at me. All right, everybody, we're going to be going over the use of Sim Man, and uh, actually, Mega Code Kelly is what she is, and we're going to be using the Sim Box. As we're looking down here, you can see that the box is connected, and I've got the pulse um, tube connected, but I'm not going to be using that right now. So I'm going to hit the power button on my link on my uh, link pad or my link box uh, one time, and that's going to start blinking. As we're waiting, we're going to be listening to Mega Code Kelly, and she's going to cough. That right now it's going through a uh, self-test, and so we're waiting for that, so go ahead and pause. All right, see the tickers? Okay, right now you've seen that the, uh, we just heard the cough, so we've got two green lights and we've heard the cough. So once you have two green lights and you hear the cough from Mega Code Kelly, I'm gonna take the link box and I'm gonna turn the power on, and the link box, or their SIM pad, I'm sorry, SIM pad will start powering up. And you can see the light, light coming on, and my link pad is now powering up. As that's powering up, look back down here, you're going to you have the two lights. You can see the two lights, the, the two green lights, one of them is going to turn blue as it's generating the signal for the SIM pad. So link box, link box, SIM pad. And I'm waiting for the blue light to pop up to let it know that it's generating the signal and that the SIM pad is receiving it. And that's what I'm waiting on right now. So go ahead and pause. Four, three. Okay, you can see I've got a blue light and a green light, and my pad is on. So now take a look at the pad. So for my pad, what I'm going to do is I'm going to, in this case, I'm going to use the manual mode, and it's connecting. You can see it's starting up. And what we're going to be programming today is lung sounds. Okay. And you have to wait for the manual mode, and you'll see the bar ticking down, starting up. So from here, I'm just going to go to respiration. And I'm just going to use asthma, doesn't really matter. I'm going to change it anyway and click OK. Now, once I hit start, I can start playing with things. I'm going to go to the lung sounds. From the lung sounds, I click on lung sounds. I want to give him a some coarse crackles in the right. And we're going to give him some strider in the left. We're going to bring up the volume a little bit to make it easier to hear on both sides. You can change that however you want and click activate. Now, at this point, if you get close enough, you can actually hear him do it. And that's all you have to do to program lung sounds. I can go to cardiac. I can go ahead and play with the heart rate. Activate. That makes it happen. Um... If I want to go back to the lung sounds, we're going to go ahead and give him a strider and see if we can hear it. I'm going to pump up the volume, see if we can hear it on the audio. And if you get down close enough, mm -hmm. you can actually hear the strider. Okay? And if you go to voice sounds, make him cough. Anything. Even say a few things. All right, now... When you're done for the day, or you're done with the, with the lab, what we're gonna do is I'm gonna, you have the power button on the top here, not the yellow button, the power button on top. And I'm gonna hit the power button. The SIM pad is gonna ask me if I wanna shut down the whole thing. Yes, I wanna do. I wanna shut down the SIM pad and the link box. That's gonna shut down the mannequin, the link box, and the pad. And then when you're done, make sure you put the pad back in the sleeve, and you always look at it right over there. It says SIM pad right over there on the far right. You see the SIM pad. And make sure you plug it in. And that is the entire video for doing lung sounds and heart sounds. And end.